Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Baron Fig Squire Click. And I gotta tell you, I checked out the Squire Rollerball a little bit ago, and I was not at all unhappy with that. I like that one a lot. So, a uh, quick comparison here. This one is five inches, and it's a little bit thinner than the other one, and it's also a little bit lighter than the Squire Rollerball. So, let's open this thing up and take a look at it. I gotta tell you, I'm kind of a fan of clicky pins. I never realized it until recently, but I don't think I'm a big fan of pin caps. Ooh. Well, this one looks kind of cool. Can y'all hear that? Okay. This might just be me, but I was expecting a click. And maybe we're too elegant for clicks? So let's see. This is a Baron. Big. Square. Click. It's click, right? Yeah. It's a square click. Okay. So, I'm less crazy about the ink cartridge in the last one. So, let's see about this one. You unscrew it here. Oops. You unscrew it there. And. Looks like another Parker Jada refill. We'll test it out to make sure. We'll steal one out of our friendly neighborhood Parker Jotter. See if this one, see how this works. All right. Just screw it back in like so. Uh, Parker, Jotter, Compatible. Alright, so that's not bad. Hmm. It's a pretty solid feeling pen. I mean, I kind of, I mean, I, I like the pen. I'm not super crazy about this refill, but overall, it's not bad. I kind of like the, I kind of like the fact that the top part unscrews instead of the bottom or the middle. I miss the actual clickiness, but I guess the thing is, if you don't like the click, then this might be a perfect pen for you. And this one is like, I'll include a link in the description to the website for the pen. I think it's like $35 or something. Anyway, that's what I paid for. I, I think I paid like $35 for it. And it's, it's a nice, clean looking pen. I mean, it really is like undeniably sort of has a little elegance to it hmm. not bad I like it and as with since it takes since it takes Parker Jotter compatible refills if you are so inclined and you wanted to you can use a Fisher Space Pen refill in it you can use one of their um, the, the Sp Fisher Space Pen refills come with a little adapter you basically put it on top and you can there it makes them Parker Jotter compatible so if you want to you could have this as your write anywhere pen and anyway nice looking pen 
Um, let me know what you think. Have y'all tried this out? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Is it something you think you might like? Are you weirded out by it not having a clip? Not having a pocket clip? I didn't think about that until just now. Yeah, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to think about that about whether I like it or don't like it without a pocket clip. Hmm. Definitely a choice. Hmm. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And I hope y'all have an excellent day.